The St. Paul Police Department is offering an auto care clinic to help drivers protect a frequently stolen item, those catalytic converters. Since the beginning of the year, 600 catalytic converters have been stolen from St. Paul residents. That's six a day. WCCO's Reg Chapman has more on what police hope will help deter these thefts. There's people waiting over a week to get in here, two weeks. Dave Peterson is working hard to keep up with demand. Since the beginning of this year, the biggest part of his business has been replacing stolen catalytic converters. Two to three hundred or more. His crews are replacing at least 15 catalytic converters a day. Peterson believes because it is so lucrative to sell those stolen converters, they are being taken at an alarming rate. Yes, it's the precious metal, rhodium, palladium, uh, platinum, and it's the highest it's ever been. Right now, it's higher than gold right now per ounce. It's a serious, significant problem, and we want to try to do something. St. Paul PD has a plan they hope will help deter thieves. We're going to try to spray paint a little template on the catalytic converter that says SPPD on it. We're going to try, if we can get underneath the vehicle, to uh, engrave the license plate number of the vehicle that the catalytic converter is on. Commander Kurt Hallstrom uses a high temperature spray paint good for up to 2,000 degrees. He hopes the marked catalytic converters will keep people from taking them and others from purchasing them. So we're hoping that, you know, the, the scrap yards and the people that are buying them will see these markings and, and you know, grindings uh, on the catalytic converter and say, yeah, I'm not going to buy that one or I'm not going to give you premium dollar for that. Six a day are reported stolen, but police believe that does not represent the number of catalytic converter thefts that are never reported. Peterson says he supports St. Paul PD's efforts and is also painting the ones he installs orange. Plus, when I install are made with ceramic inside, they're worth, if they do try to cut them and get them, they're worth about eight to eighteen dollars. Reg Chapman, WCCL 4 News. The auto care clinic tomorrow at Allianz Stadium is full. St. Paul police are planning future clinics to help meet the demand.